out here in a scoreless ball game. Robert Morris losing the first game 8-0 as a bunt is laid down and the Colonials will come home with it. And a nice job by Riggle to underhanded to the catcher Eisenberg and Eisenberg gets a nice tag down to get the out at home plate. So the fielders choice opportunity here to get their first lead of the day. And Higgins ropes this one into right center field. It'll sail past the center fielder, scooped up by the right fielder, and the Colonials will bring two runs home on the RBI single for Higgins. First pitch high and outside, and a stolen base attempt and a nice slide by Hadley. The tag was applied, but Hadley had already slid past the tag by Higgins, and the stolen base... And this one bounced back towards home, or back towards the patch pitcher, where Riggle will scoop, and uh, another run will come in as Eisenberg. The 2-1 pitch. Hit right up the middle. The Colonials will bring Cap home. LaRusso rounds third. The ball rolling into the infield, and a two-RBI single. Ball being cut off there by first baseman Kovac. She had a play at the plate if she'd throw it, but... She did not. She held up, looked at the first baseman instead. I think she would have had a play at the plate. This ball roped into center field. Scooping it up is Bunner, and the throw is cut off by Miller. One for two today. Reached on a fielder's choice in the first, and then... Doubled as a great play made by Stacy Cap to finish up inning number three, or rather four. So that'll do it for the Manisi. Here's the pinch runner for the Bucknell Bison, and she'll look to tag, but uh, we'll get tossed oh. out there. Wow, what a play, heady play there by the Colonials right fielder, Taylor Bartlow. Basically what happened was Hadley popped one out into right field. A feign at a tag advance by Manisi, and Manisi leisurely went back towards first base. A strong throw from Bartlow back to Miller. And the Colonials sent Bunner out to center field. Gerganis. Pops this one up into left field. It'll carry him off of the glove of the left fielder. And then a nifty sidestepping slide by Bunner. She will get her hand down on the dish. And the Colonials take the lead back 6-5 to five as Bunner was able to avert the tag. Still got two outs. Ball bounced over towards the shortstop. And the ball is gloved by Higgins. And that ball bounced in the left field, and Bucknell has reclaimed the lead on a RBI single from Kovach. Started for Bucknell here in the top of the seventh inning. Great play there by Madison Riggle, the tall.